Uh, model room's gotten a little messy over the past uh, couple years of doing model car hobby headquarters videos. But, uh, you know, we can do something about this. I think we can get it straightened up again. It was a lot worse, you know, a couple years ago when we got it all straightened up. And I think I got an idea. So, you know, what do you guys think? Should we clean this mess up? I added a lot of kits to the collection since uh, we started this whole channel and doing this show. So, eh, got a project going on there, a little Ford Escort. We'll get to showing you that here in a few minutes. And we got a whole bunch of things to talk about. So, uh, yeah, I think it's time for it's time for an overhaul. Hello my fellow car modelers, how you doing today? Yeah, I know you haven't seen me in a while, I haven't been doing much on the uh, the old YouTubes. Sorry about that, but a lot's been going on and I've kind of touched a little bit in my last videos, but this is a real special video. Uh, not going to be a lot of model building on this one, as a matter of fact there's not going to be any model building on this one, but it's more of something I want to share with you guys that I think uh, I think you guys would be interested, maybe, I don't know, or you'll just, just shut it off. Here we are in the Lucasy Model Room Studios, slash, slash, studios, or whatever it would be. I lived in this house for almost two years and didn't set the model room up, and you guys were there when I finally set it up. That was almost two years ago, or it was a year, I don't know, I'm, I'm screwed up with my years. So, what I have to say is, uh, well, it's the end of an era. I guess we could say it was an era. It was like we're coming up to in October will be two years since I started the channel. It was a lot of the channel that got me back in, involved in the hobby and back and putting my model room together and then coming in here and enjoying whenever I would have the time. Didn't get a lot of model building done like I had hoped, but you know we we worked on a few things and we got to show you some stuff and you know we've got that flip nose Chevelle going. I know you guys, yeah, I haven't, you probably think I've left it. No, it's coming back. But this is the video that for the last time we're going to be in this model room. It's, it's over. It's done. This is all going to start coming down. I got to box all this stuff up and all that stuff. You saw me building it in that, in that episode that uh, I hope you guys all, you want to watch again. It was fun. We put this model room together. Well, looks like we're going to be doing that again because uh, we're moving to another place that in in that direction. Luckily, it's just around the corner. It's going to take me a while over the next month and a half. Uh, we're probably looking at we'll start really pumping out videos in like September because over this next month and a half, we're going to be doing our moving and cha changing things and cleaning. But we bought a home. And, uh, wow, do I have a place to make videos now, and I'm going to have a really big model room. It's going to be really cool. And, well, you know what? I tell you what. We're not totally moved in there. It's a little bit of a wreck, but uh, come on. Let me, let me show you. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take you over there right now. Let's go look at the new place. Huh? What the heck, right? All right, so we're camera phoning it here, and I'm pulling into my... Long driveway. Always wanted a long driveway. But here we go. And, uh, and how cool is this? See who already has made a home for himself. Yeah. Half hour after I got the keys handed to me, the first thing I brought over was the old little fox body. So let's go take a look at the place. Yeah, got some bars for added security because you know we gotta have uh, the uh, Lucas E compound has to be safe. And I got those bars to put on the outside windows, because especially that one, that is my grandson's room. We'll see that in a little bit. But yeah, so now I got that from that one car garage. My welder is already over here, my air compressor. We've got a lot more tool stuff to bring over but yeah this is uh 
where we'll do some mods to to this thing here um, bad tire flat tire I gotta get a new tire too big of a hole to patch that happened like a couple weeks ago and I just haven't had time to deal with it so I haven't been able to drive it much but I've been just too busy with dealing with this and so got some old cabinets in here that's pretty cool uh, right before we go in the house just show you we got a backyard to do things at I don't know this whole porch and everything but uh, this already is the basis for what I'm probably going to build another room here to do other Lucasy activities here but uh, that's pretty much there and let's go into the place now it's kind of wrecked we've been starting to move stuff in so nothing's really set so are you ready let's go in yeah a little dark but it's nice and cool in here but yeah it's a pretty big space here's the kitchen with stuff scattered all over the place again we just opening boxes starting to find places for stuff so this this isn't how we live here it's just we're moving in so big nice table to have some you know dinner guests over <laughs> but like you can see this is the whole uh, dining area type thing entertaining area or whatever we might do um, kitchen there's a wall with wood on it that's pretty cool but uh, this area here is going to be my daughter's YouTube channel studio basically and where she does all her cosplays and if any of you have seen any of her videos you know who that is that's that's Cashew there that's her her fursona and she will sometimes have Cashew on her videos and check them out they're pretty funny and then this room is going to be kind of a gaming YouTube studio for both Vince and my daughter get their channels rolling again and uh you know we're gonna do all kinds of stuff in here youtube wise and and probably have like editing we'll do here but uh i can hear my grandson he knows i'm here and that's the entryway and this is a cool thing because if you guys <laughs> uh, got your own room and you're crying his big room he's not used to it in our old house he had a uh he, all he could do is just be in this so right across from felix's room this is the lucas e studios yeah nothing to see nothing to see yet there it is this will be my model room lucas e studios and actually my bedroom too <laughs> i'm moving into one room in the house not kind of the garage and other things, but I've got a big, let's see, turn the light on in here. Oh, I can go up in the attic too and hang out. I've got a big closet that I will not keep. Well, I'll keep clothes over here, but the rest is gonna be models. But check it out. So this is the plan. With kind of the same setup I have at the other place. I'll have my whole workbench and kind of at an angle here. I might have the computer over here or over there and of course the walls will be stacked and covered you know we just did a new paint job because when I came into this room I'll show you a picture it, it was this god-awful peach and I thought I could live with it because I was going to cover the walls but I was like oh no and there were a few rooms that were bad so my son-in-law said I will paint because he used to be a painter and we went over to Lowe's and I picked out a color that popped in my head was this like olive drab green. I don't know why, I just, I wanted this green in the worst way. So I'm really pleased with it. So but like I said, you probably won't really see these walls much because we're gonna cover them. Cover them with models. Maybe a couple pictures, mostly models. You know, who needs a bedroom when you got a model room, right? And check this out. You look right here, I got my own bathroom. Cause, heck yeah, I took the master bedroom. I'm the old man. So, I got my own bathroom. But who needs that? Who needs to see that, right? Yeah, whatever. So, 
yeah, I just want to show you guys the new digs. We're going to be moving in. We're getting a lot of it handled. We've got the TV here, so that's, that's, that's important so I can watch YouTube. That's pretty much what I do with TV nowadays. And, uh, yeah, I got a lot of space now. This, this actually, at the old house, I had two rooms. And this is more square footage than my two rooms at the old house. The old house is really tiny from what you probably saw from the videos in the past. But like I said, we've got a whole bunch of space in this, in this house that, uh, that we can really do some production on all, all three of our channels. So, oh, she's feeding the boy now. Yeah. So thanks a bunch. Let's uh, let's get back to the old place and finish up this video. And got a couple more things to tell you and a couple more ideas. So, so that that's where it's going to be. That's what we're going to do. And we're going to do all kinds of videos. I got other interests and I want to make videos on. And so this channel is going to have a lot of other stuff. We're going to keep the model car stuff going, but that's why we've got the new channel name. But we're going to have Model Car Hobby Headquarters as a show on this channel. And uh, we're going to be doing stuff with real cars. And we might be venturing out in other areas that I have interest in. That Who knows? Lots of times I've met a lot of model car builders that have other interests that uh, are the same as mine. So, you know, it's, it's, let's, let's not be so narrow-minded about things. I, I want to cover all kinds of stuff. I just want to do videos on everything that excites me and interests me. That's why I started this channel. So... Hence the new change. What do you think of the new name? At the time of this taping, I'm not 100% what the name is, but you know, it, it's a cool name. I think. I, I hope so. I hope. I hope it works out. I hope. I hope everyone likes it. But you know, you guys all know me, and you know where to find me. So, and if you're already, you're already, uh, you know, uh, subscribed, it's no, no problem. It's still the same. Still, still the same logo. I just wanted to do some different stuff, and I wanted to start doing stuff with my car. And now, as you saw, I got a nice big garage to work in, and I want to do some cool stuff in there. It's all about, you know, having having fun with, with our hobbies. It's been quite an adventure this year, I, honestly, doing this house thing. It's, it's why you haven't seen me. Um, we have spent, like, a lot of our extra free time, and not to mention we were both, my daughter and I, were getting promoted at work. We both work for the same company. And it was taking a lot of our time. So we were spending so much time between work and looking for a house and getting this thing going. And any of you who bought a house knows, wow, what what a what an adventure in itself it is. And that took almost two and a half months to, to go from, we like this house, let's get it, to the keys getting handed to us last week. And, you know, so... And now it's in the middle of the frickin' summer and I'm moving. And any of you have ever been to Arizona and know what it's like to try to do things outside in the middle of the day. It, it sucks your life with the heat. It, it, it sucks your life away. It just sucks your soul. Oh, the heat. Oh, boy. So glad that you... Uh, you know got to come over and check out the house i'm gonna make videos as i'm putting the new room together uh i'm not gonna you know I, but right now i gotta you know i got a lot of this to deal with so <laughs> i gotta start good thing i saved all my boxes um it takes a lot of boxes to put these models away so yeah we're back to building a new model room that's gonna be fun so when we get go and get that model room put back together we're going to get back on that 66 Malibu flip nose I got a couple other models I've been working on here and there that I want to finish hey you want to see something really quick that I'm I'm I'm, I'm working on yeah, this video is going on what the hell I'm going to show you so here's my little escort I got it all primed and I'm probably going to do one more prime session on it and uh get painting it I got an idea for a cool paint job I'm kind of inspired by the old uh Back in the 80s, the old Ford Motorsports paint schemes that were white with blue and all that. I, I really like that kind of color combination. I think I'll just like do some striping up here of three different shades of blue and the rest of the car white. And I already kind of got the theme going with the uh, 
the underside and the inside here in the roll cage all painted white and they're ready to go and some of the suspension components black different shades of black just a simple model I'm not going to detail it I'm not going to go too nuts but I just want it to be a simple clean model I'd like to take it to uh, a show I got planned for in November that uh, um, I hope to have it all done for that and maybe a couple other models we will see but I'll be bringing some news on that show coming up here on a upcoming video so you'll see about that show soon other than that this is what I've been working on here I got the wheels and tires and I think I've uh, showed a couple mock-ups of the of the car but uh, yeah I gotta pack it all up now and move on over to the new house but I just want to show you guys what I've been kind of tinkering with I really haven't had a lot of time like I said work has has taken up a lot of my time and also looking for the house and financing the house and everything and whew, that's over so on to the next step let's move so what do you think of that I, I got some cool ideas with that it might be a little different you know some guys might not like this but I always found that European Ford Escort really fascinating and and it's come up before in my videos and I found that kit last year at the IPMS show I was just so stoked and I've been having a lot of fun putting it together haven't had a lot of time to build so it's been going a little slower than I thought being kind of a curbside I thought I'd blow that one out fast but I need to get a model finished I never finished a model at this house but maybe that little Ford will be the first one I get done at the new house and then we'll get rolling on that 66 Malibu because I gotta have that thing done thanks a bunch for uh, supporting the channel thanks a bunch for watching if you haven't subscribed please subscribe like and do some comments down there i read them all i know you guys see me see me uh you know nod to you when you when you do a comment i do read them all i like the input you guys have to say and we still have our teespring store with shirts and everything for for this channel that you want to get and again there's model car hobby headquarters stuff again the channel might be changing the name but we're still model car hobby headquarters here on this show and get on over to the facebook group model car hobby headquarters it's getting bigger and bigger. I'm always, you know, having new people sign up. There's tons of model builders there. There's some great stuff getting posted on there. Uh, you know, there's guys with some great ideas, and I've been getting some tips and things now off of there. It's been it's been really starting to really pick up. That uh, that's a great Facebook group. Everybody has a great attitude on there, and uh, you know, we're going to be doing some more stuff over there with some contests and some more, you know talking about the shows and I always if you if you're there and you're a member of that I always whenever I have a new video I put it up on that group and uh, you know you'll find out about the videos there and then maybe we'll start doing some exclusive stuff just for the Facebook page that's uh, model car hobby headquarters Facebook page that's not going to change its name it's always going to be model car hobby headquarters and uh, you know we, we we're gonna go on with life so man Thank you guys so much. This was kind of fun doing this. I've been kind of out of the loop. It was weird, uh, but it's nice, you know. So, my cold cup of coffee. As always, go. And uh, well, heck, what did we? What did we? How do we end these videos? I can't remember. It's been so long time. What is it? I, what? What? Can you tell me? What? What? Is, oh. Oh yeah, so we gotta remember to keep gluing those fingers together and keep cutting that styrene. And we will see you in the next video. Video. I got a little chair. So, we will, uh, we're gonna, we gotta, put the gun down, what, put the gun down, shh, so the first meal in this house should be, um, spaghetti, huh, <laughs> wasn't that a thing? Some 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 people like the spaghetti bit. <coughs> I'm making spaghetti. <coughs> <laughs> he wants spaghetti. He'll probably wear most of the he'll, spaghetti. He'll eat anything. Look at him. Yeah, no kidding. Look, I could get this big scoop. 
<laughs> talking, talking, just been talking. It's almost like a vlog. It's really not Mel Car Hobby headquarters, but a hey, uh Hey, hey, what you, hey, I, I've lost my brains here. I don't remember what the hell I was talking about. So, you know, I don't know if we're going to, I don't know, maybe have a collector's edition shirt and all four of you that buy shirts will, will maybe get one. I don't know. I'll come up with something new. What the heck? Anyways, get on over to the Facebook channel. Oh, my God. Get on over to the Facebook group. Is it a group or page? Okay, let's try this. There's some great stuff getting cast. Oh, God. So there's tons of model of... All right, all right, I'm done.